Hello, I'm Erica Sargent with CBS Chicago. Here are stories making news at this hour. Police in Houston say a suspect wanted for killing a former doctor for President George H.W. Bush has killed himself. Kenneth Craig reports now from New York. The shocking murder of Dr. Mark Houseconnect gripped the city of Houston for two weeks. Now the suspect, Joseph James Pappas, accused of gunning down that doctor in broad daylight while both were riding bicycles, is also dead. A suicide after a confrontation with police in a residential neighborhood. One single shot to the head, self-inflicted gunshot. The esteemed cardiologist once treated former President George H.W. Bush. Police say the mother of the 62-year-old suspect was also a patient of Dr. House Connect and that he held a 20-year grudge over surgery that ended in her death. They say Pappas kept a file on the doctor. There was information on the residence, information on where he works, information on the doctor, information on his cars, but I'm not going to just I'm not going to list it all because I don't think there's value right now in that other than to say that uh, that it was very extensive. And police revealed he also had the names of a couple of dozen Texas Medical Center employees, but stopped short of saying they were also targets. I don't think we have enough information to say I was a hit list. Police say that development was forwarded to medical center officials and that the criminal investigation continues. Kenneth Craig, CBS News. And here is meteorologist Mary Kay Kleist with your hot forecast. Today we're enjoying a bit of a lake breeze, but over the weekend the lake breeze turns off and everybody heats up into the 90s for daytime highs. So the water temperature is holding in the 70s. We're getting a little breeze off the lake. So downtown right now it's 72 at the lakefront, 76 in Waukegan, but it's 87 degrees right now in Ottawa, Joliet. So warmer as you head away from the lake. Well, as we look around the region this weekend, it looks like temperatures are going to be building. We have high pressure in control and we're going to see a lot of hazy sunshine. We're already seeing that now. So as you go through your evening tonight, we'll hold close to 70. But look at the weekend, Saturday and Sunday. Those warm southwesterly winds get a little gusty late in the weekend, and that is going to close off any lakefront cooling. So both days we're talking highs in the middle 90s.